Hi everyone, Miss Emily back here for another story time at Josephine Ford's Playhouse at Ford House. Today I'm reading a story called A Family is a Family is a Family. It's written by Sarah O'Leary and it's illustrated by Chin Lang. And the reason I chose this book is because Ford House was created for a family. The parents were Edsel and Eleanor Ford and their children were Henry, Benson, Josephine, and William. And they all grew up here. And it's very important right now to remember how wonderful family can be. And families come in all shapes and sizes, and that is A-OK. -okay. And that is what my story about is about today. It's about families and how they are all different and all wonderful. So, a family is a family is a family. We were talking about families at school. The teacher asked us, what we thought made our family special. I went last. I wasn't sure what to say. My family is not like everybody else's. My mom and dad have been best friends since first grade. They really like each other. It's kind of gross. There are lots of kids in our family. Mom and Dad just keep coming home with more. Can you spot all the kids? I like the ones under the sink. <laughs> both my moms are terrible singers and they both like to sing really loud. I have more grandparents than anybody else I know. We have a new baby in our house. I think my mom ordered him online. Okay, so you see, she thinks the baby was shipped. We all look alike in my family, which is kind of go together. They're all on the bike. One week mom gets me, the next week dad does. Fair is fair. So it looks like mom and her are painting, but then her and dad are going to a game. Some people say I look like my dad. Some people say I look like my mom. I think I look like myself. My mom says that before I was born, I grew in her heart. Because I live with my grandmother, people sometimes think she's my mother. She's not, she's my everything. Some of the kids were dads when he met mom. Some of the mom, some were moms when she met dad. Now we all belong to each other. One of my dads is tall and one of my dads is short. They both give good hugs. I listened to everybody else, and then I remembered the time someone saw us all together in at the park. She asked my foster mother to point out her real children. Oh, I don't have any imaginary children, Mom said. All my children are real. A family is a family is a family. I love that story, and I was very inspired by this story, but also my own family to make an art project. So be sure to check out the next video that'll have the art project in it. And I'll see you all next week for a new story and a new art project. Bye everyone.